IBM, throughout its history, has been helping people to accomplish more and maximize their full potential. Our first card punching machine helped complete the 1890s US Census two years faster. As IBM expanded, we started focusing on even more difficult and demanding tasks. Very soon, IBM brought people with disabilities in the spotlight and in 1914, we hired our first disabled employee. Since then, numerous inventions have demonstrated our continued commitment to people living with disabilities. In today's world of global connectivity and the Internet of Things, this commitment is still part of our core values. Using new, more powerful hardware equipped with sophisticated sensors, our ability to understand the environment around us using advanced software algorithms is taking a giant leap forward. Our mission is to capitalize on this momentum and combine with the cognitive capabilities of Watson to bring visually impaired people closer to complete autonomy. Our puzzle solving toolkit is uh, just a glimpse of uh, how far we have come. It uh, leverages um, artificial intelligence techniques and uh, computer vision techniques uh, to help the user solve a jigsaw puzzle. The first piece is the one in the middle. The toolkit also leverages some of the Watson services like uh, speech-to-text and text-to-speech to have a natural interaction with the user. The next piece is the second on the right. Congratulations, you solved the puzzle. My team and I are building tools to help visually impaired people gain better situational awareness. What that means is that we can help them understand where they are, what kind of objects are nearby, and if there are other people around. On your left is a bottle. In front of you is a cup. On your right is a mouse. This helps visually impaired people uh, better engage with their environment. The spectrum of possible application is endless, and we're looking to enable people to accomplish more complex and challenging everyday tasks at a rapid pace. Using our assets, we can warn workers of hazardous objects in conditions with limited visibility, but also help them to navigate to the closest exit in case of emergency. What we're trying to do is to build technology and deploy it for people with visual impairment to make their life easier and more autonomous.